Hi, and welcome to this quick demo of the Loop Maker. The new version of the Loop, make, Loop Maker now runs from the window menu. So you install it in the Script UI Panels folder and you select it here. Um, and it's very simple to use. You basically take a clip, you create a comp, or if you already have it in a comp, you basically select where you want to loop. So for this clip here, I would not loop this sort of segment where the fish are running in a circle. So I'm just going to set an endpoint. I'm just going to drag the in point here for the where I want the loop to start and then I'm going to go to the end here and set the out point here so now it will basically loop this little segment here so you just select the layer you want to loop you can actually have several layers selected if you'd like but in this case we'll just do one then you basically tell it how long you would like the dissolve to be since I'm not really sure how long this clip is the default of 60 is good and then use blend effect is it uses the effect called uh, blend it's under channel blend and it actually creates a more cinematic looking dissolve when it does the loop but if you have say like a transparent background or something sometimes it doesn't actually work as expected so in that case just turn it off and it uses the opacity for the layer there's a help tip by the way that says what it does anyway so let's just go ahead and loop it it says that the uh, the, the dissolve length, 60 frames, is too long for the uh, duration of the selected footage. So it tells you what the longest that it can actually create. In this case, it's 31 frames. So let's just go ahead and do 31 frames. So there we go. And what it does is it actually creates a little expression. So you can actually extend it both in the back and in the front. You can go sort of in both directions. And it just loops. So if we just preview this, you'll see here that it... Uh, it's just basically uh, dissolving the clip back onto itself. So it, it um, oops, turn off the audio there. So you can see that it just basically creates this this loop for you. What's cool is that um, you know, it, you can actually see the pre comp that I created, which is the looped pre comp. So when we open this up, you can see here that uh, it actually has the blend effect applied. So uh, so that's it. Um, the other big news about this version of the Loop Maker is now it is actually uh, international, uh, localized for international use. So at the moment, it's been translated into five different languages, and I'm very happy about that. And so it actually gives you everything, all of the prompts and all the error messages and everything in in one of these languages. And if and if it's not one of the languages, it'll give it to you in English, but you can actually run the plugin or the script as before you couldn't. So. Very excited about this uh, new version, so please uh, enjoy.